Hello, my name is Ms. Wendy Robinson, and I'd like to welcome you to University Elementary School's Back to School Night. A little bit about myself. As you can see by the three icons, I enjoy traveling, movies, and definitely math. Our daily schedule from Monday to Friday, classes begin at 8.41 a.m. and end at 2.48 p.m. There's two periods of math or English, followed by a special such as art, gym, music, or library. And then after, students will have one period of science and social studies, as well as lunch throughout the day. Course outline. This year we'll be focusing on extending knowledge of place value, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. We'll also be using and applying the eight standard math practices, as well as applying real world problem solving skills. I'll assign between five to 10 problems per lesson per day. Homework will be given between Monday and Friday. There'll also be a quiz normally once a week on a Wednesday and a test about every two weeks on a Friday covering what we've learned in that topic. Our daily math routine begins with attendance and a do now. The do now is usually a solve and share a solve and share is just a question or a problem to get students thinking um, along the lines of that lesson for that day. After we review and discuss the solve and share, we'll then watch an instructional video that um, allows students to grasp visually the concept that we're learning for the day, as well as ask questions regarding that topic. After we complete the video, we'll have a guided practice in which I do a problem, the children do a problem, and then we all do one together. Again, this is a time to ask questions and um, to gain deeper understanding on the topic. After we've completed our guided practice, students will work independently on their problems to see and demonstrate what they've learned. Finally, we'll have an exit ticket and a closure of the lesson. For science this year, We'll be using the next generation science standards and we'll be examining one area of science per cycle. We'll be doing this by means of project-based learning and questioning centered around a specific phenomenon. The three dimensions of the next generation science standards are science and engineering practices, disciplinary core ideas, and cross-cutting concepts. The course materials for this year for in-person learning will be Savas, formerly known as Pearson Realize, iReady, Envision Math 2020, notebooks, pencils, headphones, and a Chromebook. Our grading policy is standard, as you can see to the right. Regarding our uniform grading profile for math this year, it will consist of two tests, four quizzes, six homework assignments, two projects, and eight classwork assignments. For science, there'll also be two tests, three quizzes, eight homework assignments, six projects, and six classwork assignments. Attendance. Attendance is crucial to your child's success. Please ensure that your child is in school and on time daily. Also be proactive. Notify myself and the school in advance of any planned absences as well as ensuring that your child makes up any missed assignments as soon as possible. Classroom rules and expectations. Please arrive on time, bring all needed supplies, raise your hand before speaking, be respectful of yourself and others, and remain positive and try your best. Behavior policy. For rewards, I often do dojo points, positive praise, and a positive phone call home. Students often associate um, having a phone call with a negative experience, but I'd like them to know that I would like to speak to you, not just for bad things, but for good as well, such as being kind, solving a problem, or actually um, sticking to what we were learning today and persevering. For consequences, I'll issue a verbal warning. If that doesn't work, it'll be followed by a time for reflection or a timeout, and as a last resort, parent conference. Arrival and dismissal procedures. Students will be picked up, um, I'm sorry, students will be dropped off and picked up by their teachers beginning at 8.20 a.m. Teachers will remain outside until 8.40 a.m. 
And in the event of inclement weather, students will be dropped off um, either in the cafeteria or in the gym based on their grade level. Dismissal. Students are escorted to their exit in preparation for pickup by 2.50 p.m. Teachers will remain outside until 3 p.m. and any remaining students will be escorted to the main office. COVID safety procedures. Masks must be worn throughout the day and students must enter the building wearing a mask. In addition, students wear face shields throughout the day. Face shields are labeled and stored in the classroom for daily use. Classrooms are also provided with hand sanitizer for both students and staff. And finally, the desks are facing in a single direction um, and it includes a clear partition for students to see. We also reinforce proper mask wearing, as you can see in the photos, the do's and don'ts of wearing a mask. Finally, please free, feel free to contact me at any time. You may do so at my email, which is wyrobinson at irvington.k12.nj.us or on Class Dojo. I look forward to seeing you and working with you this school year. Have a wonderful day.